everyone today we're gonna be making a tier list for all the weapons and all the prodigies so yeah guys if you want to see that stay tuned so yeah let's go okay so we're not gonna make like a casual tier list like me ranking them like each one you know so we're gonna do something else i'm just gonna tell you like briefly what it does what the the weapon does what the prodigy does and where i would put it in like like for beginners and for fucking you know uh like more advanced people so yeah first things first is the direct shot direct shot is not that good honestly it's pretty bad so like nobody nobody plays direct shot it's not good for beginners nor for advanced uh, players so i don't recommend it at all if there was a tier list i would put it in like let's say d tier i guess yeah it's the worst one maybe even f like you can do you can get a goal with this for sure but it's not that good finesse shot it's pretty goofy because like you you it's basically like nerfed pka it's literally that so yeah if you get it you get for for beginners it's not it's okay it's not crazy good you're not gonna be able to score a lot of goals but it can work sometimes so yeah i would put it in like i guess d tier and the direct shot is f tier stealthy steps is <laughs> as you know uh my favorite one of the epic ones so definitely stealthy steps is one of the best ones for beginners i recommend getting stealthy steps because you can get a lot of space and you cannot get the ball stolen from you when when you're in the animation so it's really really good in my opinion at least it's pretty pretty amazing it's probably like low s tier in my opinion so yeah it's it's one of the the best one ones yeah the, one of the best weapons definitely next one uh explosive acceleration this one is pretty decent too it's essentially like stealthy steps you get a lot of space but you can uh, you can get uh, the ball stolen from you uh, in the animation so be careful with that therefore uh, i would put it in like maybe eight tier, low eight tier, pretty decent if you get it and if you don't have a lot of spins left i would suggest you you keep it for a while for beginners it's good for advanced people it's also okay if you know how to use it okay but before the video continues i would like to ask you guys uh to subscribe to my channel because we're coming close to 1k subs hey yo that's a big goal we're close to achieving it come on so yeah if you would want to you can subscribe right now and yeah let's continue on with the video okay um next one is jumping power jumping power is the worst epic maybe maybe it's fucking even rare or common in my opinion it's not that good so it's not good for even like uh new or advanced players so i don't uh, recommend using it it's pretty goofy honestly so now we're getting with the um, legendary and prodigious weapons mark smell it's really decent for uh defense if you're close to the goal and someone is dribbling and trying to score you can you can most likely get the ball with this it's pretty decent but it's kind of like um the hitbox is sometimes weird sometimes you get it sometimes you don't so yeah it's probably like low a tier in my opinion good for um new players that are defenders and for advanced players if you want to be a defender next one uh immense speed it's honestly uh i'm disappointed at it because yeah the speed can be nice and all that but sometimes it's really easy to get the ball stolen from you like it's crazy how easy it can be like if you have a player right here he can just slide and you cannot do anything about it and you will get uh, the ball stolen from you so be careful about that probably like b tier 
for new players and for advanced players maybe in the normal game it can be eight years sometimes because you have a lot of space but if you're in the league maybe like the 2v2s or 3v3s it's not that good so yeah okay um next one we're going to the prodigious weapons these ones are crazy i'ma tell you straight up all of them are in my opinion s tier uh they're different of course so they're the best ones of right so you can use every single one for different things right so pka you use it for scoring elastic dribbling you use it for making space and breaking fucking ankles you know and trapping you use it to trap the ball and also to make space and maybe it, it can be used for defense sometimes i'm gonna tell you how so the this the black hole trap i think you can um use this and get the ball because it has a lot of hitbox and like if you're uh, close to the goal you can use it and get the ball like maybe when the opponent shoots you can get the ball which is pretty good trap shot it's basically like when you use the black hole trap you uh need to use this again and then shoot the ball it's not a good move because uh, aiming it is hard but it can be uh useful sometimes so yeah creative trap it's pretty decent for space zero reset uh, return it's this one is pretty pretty okay in my opinion because you see th that's a lot of space which you can create by just this one move so yeah it's really good and fake volley shot it can be uh, pretty pretty decent you can fake uh, fake out a lot of people and uh, score after that so yeah it's really good this one s tier even for new players and for advanced players as i said all of them are s tier i'm just telling you how to use them pinpoint high speed kick okay this one pretty decent because you can score a lot of goals and this also works on uh, like the top beams on top right top left it can if you have enough uh, power y you can score like that too so it's pretty good and also for just normal like shots at the bottom of the goal so yeah uh, this the the curved shot the trivella it's pretty amazing i'm telling you if you know how to aim this is freaking unstoppable i'm telling you guys pretty amazing like a learning how to aim this will get you a lot of results you will score a lot and the the pass this one is also decent it has like uh it all, all the locks to your teammate so yeah you can even if he moves uh, the ball will follow him so pretty amazing pka overall it's really good for uh, scoring and creating chances in my opinion and the last one elastic dribbling okay i didn't think elastic dribbling was that good in my opinion i i was kind of dumb honestly but i got it and it's actually pretty good it's pretty amazing actually so hyper speed scissors you can hold this and you see you, you can do it a lot of times and then you um then you get a lot of space when using it as you can see this uh martial turn it's very very good <laughs> i'm playing around but yeah it's actually uh really really decent honestly it's also good for creating space all of them actually are pretty pretty, pretty fucking good for creating space so yeah mid-air elastico uh also amazing this is probably the best one for creating space but you need to uh hold the um, the mid-air elastico for a bit uh, like this is when you hold it like you go here and then you follow up follow it follow it up with one more uh what's it called uh elastico yeah so and the last one is rainbow flick this is also pretty good for space as you can see and i think you get a speed boost for a second maybe so yeah it's amazing all of them are s tier these ones this one is probably b tier a tier uh stealthy steps low s tier a tier uh maybe c b i don't know uh, this is C and this is or D and this is F tier. So yeah, that that's for the weapons, and now the prodigy types. So there are seven prodigies, and okay. So in my opinion, intellect is pretty good for starting out. Maybe until you get to level twenty-five or thirty, and after that you don't need it because you only get like double XP. That's it. 
pretty okay for beginners so yeah if you have it and you're a beginner keep it for a bit punch it's pretty decent for people who want to score more goals but you don't kill you don't get a lot of stats from this you just get a lot of power and some stamina so yeah it's okay you can keep it if you do, if you don't have any prodigy, prodigy spins or if you want to score a lot of goals with some nice power but uh, other than that i'm not sure if you want to use it now defense defense is also like good for our defenders maybe if you combine this uh, defense with uh, mark smell you get a, a bigger uh, what, what what is it bubble i guess and you can steal the ball uh, more often so yeah defense is good speed and okay speed dribble and ball control all of them are amazing all of them are pretty freaking amazing honestly so yeah ball control is in my opinion the best then go speed and then, then dribble so if i had to rank them i would rank them like this ball first place uh, speed uh, second place and dribble third place but all of them are pretty good so yeah uh, ball control can it, it gives you like a counter the counter skill is okay but like it's uh, i'm not sure how to uh, it's not like crazy good because sometimes it can make you uh, go backwards and that's not gonna benefit you benefit you but it can be clutch so yeah it's like a double-edged sword so yeah dribble dribble is pretty amazing you get you get five additional dribbles which which is amazing uh but i'm pretty sure some of these stuff are nerfed so yeah don't um uh, don't hold me on this one i think some of these are nerfed i think ball control is nerfed so yeah and uh, speed you get a lot of speed like 35 more percent which is a lot which is amazing and more stamina that's really good okay guys um i think that's gonna be it for today's video so yeah if you liked it make sure to like share subscribe and all that shit so yeah if you have any uh, any other suggestions maybe what you want to see next drop that down in the comments and yeah see you in the next video goodbye